Namaste everyone, this is uh, Toraki Chiakita from Sota and Kai Therapy Center in Kathmandu, Nepal. Um, today I would like to talk about how to boost up our immune system through external heat treatment. I mean now everybody we are doing uh, lots of uh, taking vitamin C, um, keeping your body warm, eating more vegetables, um, uh, and we, that's how we are taking care of our body. But beside that, um, there is also another one very uh, effective way to boost our immune system through external heat treatment. This was developed by Dr. Tada Masakazu uh, in Japan in early 1930s that how external heat treatment can boost our immune system. At that time, the immune system study was not well researched like now, but uh, he uh, found out how our um, immunity, our um, ability to fight against any disease um, um, can be boosted up by our uh, external heat treatment, by raising our body temperature. So first point uh, is thymus. Thymus is located just be, uh, below, five centimeter below this deeper place. You can feel the uh, bone, uh, it's a sternum. Just backside of sternum, there is an organ called thymus and uh, so you would um, need to heat this place. Thymus produces T lymphocyte uh, from B lymphocyte, and uh, it's also uh, lymphocyte is a, a, a white blood immune system of your body. Second is a liver. Uh, from right nipple to left, whole right side is a liver. It's a one biggest organ in our body, and uh, so try to and it also uh, stores your food, um, uh, nutrients, vitamins, proteins, but also. Um, uh, maintains the hormonal balance so try to uh, do heat treatment in this region it's bigger not just here but also sideways here third is a uh, small intestine is around our belly button is a small intestine so after heating the liver you would heat here with your hot water bags uh, yeah and then it helps to uh, improve your digestion also fourth is spleen spleen is located where your left elbow touches so about this point, so here also um, it uh, dis uh, destroys, uh, dissolves uh, the, um, uh, the 120 days old cells and also still it sends back the remaining proteins and vitamins to the liver. So uh, try to um, heat up this area. So fourth, sorry, fifth point is kidneys. Kidneys are located on backside here. Uh, just around where your floating, just uh, around your where the floating ribs are, eleventh and twelfth rib, uh, two kidneys. Um, so and just be, uh, above the kidney are adrenal glands. So try to heat up those areas also. And kidney uh, works a lot. Uh, it um, um, filters hundred about hundred eighty uh, liters of blood a day. So uh, try to give it also heat treatment so that it can improve its uh, function more. Sixth is a sacrum, where the bone where our tailbone is um, located. Um, so from that area, very big nerves like sciatic nerves flows down to our leg. So it's very good to um, heat up this area. Also a little bit above um, on your paravertebral muscles. So try to heat up in this area to keep it warm, keep your body warm. And last is uh, feet. Um, so try to, uh, feet is also known as second heart. Uh, um, so try to keep um, the um, feet area warm with your hot water bags. If you don't have hot water bags, you can use hot water bottles. And uh, so uh, try to do the heat treatment. So uh, you, how you can see the difference of it is uh, first take your body temperature before you do this heat treatment, external heat treatment. And then after that, uh, you take your body temperature and see how it's different. Try it out and let me know how you feel. Thank you so much for watching this video.